Welcome to our five on five. We're pleased to be joined by Rich Rosenhall talking about Winter Lights 2012. Rich, thanks for coming in. Good to see you. Thank you for having me. So what does downtown Medford have going on this weekend? Well, you know, Parks and Recreation has a whole day full of activities planned for tomorrow, Saturday, mm -hmm. December 1st. And uh, it starts, uh, well, downtown, it starts mm -hmm. at 4 o'clock at Hawthorne Park with the annual uh, the candy cane hunt, mm. followed immediately by the marshmallow roast at the picnic shelter at Hawthorne Park there. And uh, even though there's a chance, <laughs> chance, I guess if I say it, maybe it won't happen. If Even if it rains, the show's going to go on. Yeah, 4 there o'clock, you go. Okay. 415 marshmallow roast. Mm -hmm. There at 445 is the staging for the third annual children's parade oh, great. in the aquatic center parking lot just off East Main Street. Mm -hmm. Parade will leave at about five o'clock, four block walk. Yeah, it's just a vocal. Right? That's right. Okay. Just a short jaunt. Yeah. And we encourage uh, parents and bring their kids and and uh, it's sort of a zany pr procession. It follows <laughs> Santa's in the fire truck and yeah, you got all the kids uh, on the road, right? Yeah, it's, you can let them go. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> it, it, you know, even if the kids are really little, it, it's very short and it's really designed to transition between the Hawthorne Port Park activities to the Vogel mm -hmm. Plaza activities where the tree is lit. But yeah. we have uh, the University of Oregon duck uh -oh. mascot back by yeah. popular demand for the second consecutive year will be in the parade. The North Medford High School Band graciously is going to appear, be in the parade. Yeah. Rogue Valley YMCA uh, is helping us with the children's parade. And then uh, uh, we have mascots from SOU in South Medford. Mm -hmm. And so it's sort of a zany thing. Yeah, of course, yeah. With Santa it's, being in the center. Yeah, it's a lot of fun. Now, I got it since you mentioned the duck. It's almost like Democrats and Republicans. You got to mention <laughs> the beaver, uh, unable to attend. Why is that? The, the beaver, uh, Benny Beaver, Benny, yes. who was in Medford for this event last year along with the duck, it was quite the photo. Uh, <laughs> yes. uh, the, the Nickel State football game was rescheduled from yeah. September tomorrow afternoon, and yes. they, they were unable to uh, get B, uh, Benny to Medford uh, in time for the Prior parade. commitments, so yeah. It wasn't the weather that KO'd Benny. It was uh, <laughs> the football game. <laughs> Got to make sure of that. You don't want any upset Oregon State fans. That's right, yeah, and that's tomorrow. important because, you know, people might, we did say uh, we're planning on Benny and Puddles yeah. to be there again. Is that his name, just, Puddles? Uh, I, didn't, Puddles I wasn't familiar duck. with that one. Yes. Okay, I like that. All right. Okay. So free photo ops with uh, oh, wow. Puddles, and that, there was a line that really that stretched about a block down uh, wow. the street from Vogel last year just to get the picture taken with puddles. Wow, Free of cool. charge. Nice. Okay, and we we'll want to talk about the lighting and all that good stuff, but we got to take a quick break. Okay. We'll have much more with Rich in a moment. Stay with us. Welcome back to our 5 on 5. Again, we're here with Rich Rosenthal talking about Winter Lights 2012 here in downtown Medford tomorrow. What time is the Christmas tree lighting, Rich? 5.30. It okay. was listed incorrectly in today's Mail Tribune. Ooh. It's 5.30 is the illumination. Okay, all right. And, uh, and, and will Santa be there? What else is going on there? Well, Santa is center, center stage, of course, and it's photo op time, um, you know, opportunity for families. But also, it's the grand illumination of the tree. But before that happens, we have a couple of musical performances. The North Medford Band will perform, and also the Rogue Valley Chorale is yeah. uh, set to, unless it's raining too hard, but uh, okay. that's what the plan is right now. But 5.30, 5.35 is when that button is going to be pushed by uh, the mayor. Okay. And, uh, and we have a special appearance by uh, uh, Rex, the, the new recreation mascot oh. for Parks and Recreation. So Rex, the mayor the Rex and Rex mascot. will be pressing <laughs> that button about half past five. I like that. Okay, now now there is an event that is sold out tomorrow. Mm -hmm. What is that exactly? Well, uh, the first thing in the day actually for the Parks and Recreation Department is breakfast with Santa. Oh. And uh, that's not a free breakfast, hot breakfast for families. Again, another photo op with Santa. And, and, and it's been sold out for a couple months now. Wow. There are 300 uh, wow. kids and their, their parents and, and cool. grandparents coming to the Santo Community Center Saturday morning. Unfortunately, we don't have any room yeah. for any more. Yeah, we'll certainly have a lot going on in the afternoon, it looks like. And a couple, some of, some of their, there are some freebies out there this afternoon, right? Uh, that's right. Well, Starbucks will be at uh, Hawthorne Park for the candy cane hunt, the marshmallow roast. And, and then they'll be also at Vogel Plaza. Harry and David will be there uh, distributing some chocolates uh, while supplies last. And, and uh, the Mayor's Youth Advisory Commission is selling mistletoe. Oh, there you go. As a fundraiser. Hey. And, uh, and we really appreciate <laughs> Tomorrow it. Tomorrow is December 1st. Th course. That's right. It, yeah. it's, it, it seems like it's still a long way off. But, right. uh, it's appropriate, though. Absolutely. That's right. And, and yeah, mistletoe, you'd never think that would be a hot seller. Is it? 
Last year, it shocked me, but yeah, they raised quite a bit of money selling that. You never know where it might come in handy. <laughs> All right, cool. Now, uh, if, if anybody has any more questions or anything, you guys do kind of have a schedule all the time. That's right. Available. This sheet of paper has a schedule on it. It's at playmetford.com. Very nice, Rich. Great to see you. Thank Thanks you so much. Ahead. Our pleasure. Stay with us. We'll be right back.